everybody and welcome to another video on my channel today. My name is Kate Gray and today we are on the Arcom. The IP will be in the description. I want to go ahead and give a huge thank you to the Arcom for going ahead and giving me a YouTube rank on the server. It's an awesome server and I'm really honored to have been able to get the YouTube rank. So thank you guys for that. We're playing some Lucky Block SG. This is probably one of my new favorite game modes it's kind of you know it's just like sg but instead of chess you have lucky blocks and it's really random and fun as you can see we got a potion of speed and a bow and arrow and we're gonna try and get pretty geared here hopefully that is not what i was wanting but continuing on i just wanted to uh, you know talk to you guys as you've probably noticed uploads on my channel have been kind of weird the past couple of days maybe even like a week or so um mainly that's just because because of the fact that I was uploading Obsidiversal, which I hope you guys are enjoying. By the time this video comes out, Obsidiversal should have actually been over, but I'm not going to spoil anything, so you guys are going to have to go check out that series. The reason I know I got kind of behind, I'm still, as I'm recording this, I'm still trying to play catch up with that series. Um, I think everyone else is basically almost done like uploading it and I'm only I just uploaded episode 7 and I've got I think two or three more to upload still if you saw my tweets you probably know a little bit of what happened I had ordered new internet so I kind of like saved the uploading part because my old internet takes a long time to upload so my plan was was just to wait until I got my new internet where it should only take you know a couple minutes to upload what happened with the new internet was I ended up looking at like the tracking information and they had delivered it to the wrong house so I was like freaking out but then I was like well I have the address to the house they delivered it to I mean I, I could just drive there and get it so that's what I did I got in the car and I ended up driving to this random old lady's house <laughs> ended up being fine I got my package and I was excited to get home until I realized that if they had sent that package to that lady's house then that also probably means that's where you know the service was sent to so I ended up calling Xfinity which is the company that I was trying to get um, you know internet through and there wasn't anything they could really do over the phone then I ended up tweeting about it and Xfinity saw the tweets I ended up talking with a guy who you know on the team he told me to DM him but he you know gave me the impression that he was going to be able to get you know my service going so I was excited about that Is this guy hacking? That guy. Total hacks! But after a while of talking to this guy on Twitter, like after I gave him my address and everything, he then told me that Xfinity offers no service to my address. And keep in mind, I'm not like the type of person to just like order it without, you know, like checking if there was service like in my area first. I was in a Skype call with a friend of mine and he had recommended that I check out Xfinity because he had also lived or he also lived in Florida and had told me that, you know, it was a good internet company to go with and he lived not too far from me so I figured you know that they'd have service where I lived but before I even did that like while we were in the Skype call I went on the Xfinity website and I started asking you know to find out if like they had service in my area so I gave them my address that whole ordeal and they they assured me they're like yeah we have service in your area but I like was still with my current internet provider that I still have now CenturyLink and um so I was like, well, I'm going to have to end my contract with them before I can do anything. But, you know, once I do, then I'll switch over. I ended that conversation and that was maybe like a month or two months ago. I'm not really sure. I'm really bad with time. But then even before I ordered it, I got in another one. And just to be sure, I was like, you guys do have service in my area. And they assured me they're like, yep, we have service. So, you know, it wasn't like I just got on and I ordered it without, you know, asking. Literally, my life, I am stuck with this CenturyLink internet until I move. So that means uploads are still going to take five ever to upload. That is why I got a little bit behind, if you were, guys were wondering. Ouch. Are you just going to literally rod me this whole time? Got him. Ha <laughs> you saw me gap, huh? Why are you running? Ah, 
that's annoying. We got a bow spammer. What was that hit? Oh my god. Alrighty guys, I think that is going to wrap it up for today's video. I just wanted to let you guys know kind of like the backstory and why uploads as far as Obsidiversal got kind of, you know, backed up because I was planning on being able to upload them like all in one day and that just didn't happen so hopefully soon I'll have all those up for you but yeah I just kind of wanted to let you guys know about that definitely come on and check out the Arcom. it is an awesome server let's see what all they actually have TNT Wars Skyblock um, they have prison I know they have um, they have the factions which is actually still on pvp legends um lucky block sg which is what i was just playing they have a whole bunch of stuff um that you guys can come on and check out and definitely do because it is an awesome server and yeah i'll definitely be playing on here a lot more and doing some videos on here for you guys so i hope you're excited for that thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to leave a like subscribe and i will see you guys all again next time goodbye I'm going